This is the original, probably old school chewing gum. Right? Look at this. This is, like I said, this is basically what would be called the crotch of the branch. They call this the crotch for all you guys out there in the bushcrafting and wildcrafting and foraging and whatever. Uh, there you go. Basically, that's gum. That's all natural gum. And you would chew on that. A lot of, a lot of the guys I've seen, though, use it for glue. What I use it for is exactly what I'm getting it for. And then we just ball it up like this. Okay? So what we're doing, basically, is just finding these evergreen conifer trees. And uh, this one right here is aged. So I would call this aged a little bit. But this is the crotch. See, here's one doing it right here. And if it's too dry, it's hard as a rock, but if it's kind of, you know, you can still push it around. Like this one, if you had a tool of some sort, but if you're using your hand, you can just, so you're not taking the tool to it, so really you wouldn't be considered damaging a tree. You're just foraging. You're just doing something natural. So if people try to hit you for foraging or right of easement, just be careful. That's what I use. Anyway, that's what it's going to look like when you're done. It's basically a gum ball from a uh, conifer tree and uh, out of the crotch. That's what we call it, the crotch. See how it's dried out right here? But it's doing the same thing. And if you can find a fresher side of it, but that's pretty much it. That's what we're looking for. That's what we're trying to do. We're trying to achieve this resin ball, terpenol, and a lot of your plants that are good for you, especially like in the cannabinoid family and things like that, they exude this uh, sap, usually uh, out the uh, the hairs of the uh, bark or something, they exude this syrup. And, and uh, the smaller plants, the herb type plants, like in the cannabinoid family, they exude out their, uh, their hairs of their, their skin. So this is what we're after though, which is called the oil or the terpenol, which is like a gummy mineralized oil with sugars and enzymes. So basically you're getting the three they make a lot of ster uh, natural or anabolic steroids out of this too, except for the one they make out of shark liver. I don't recommend that one. It's probably heavy in mercury and stuff. Probably make you dumb. But uh, there you go. That's what we're after. When you get done, we're gonna ball it up like this. And if you use it, ball it up in your hand like this, and you keep messing it around, what happens is it'll get the stickiness off your hand and it'll dry out and then it'll have a protective coating. And now we have a gumball. This is the original, probably old school chewing gum.